Is that level? No, it's not. We just wait for that tractor to go by. A huge thank you to Whale for sponsoring this video, which has enabled me to bring you all the news from the Irwin Heimer Group UK. Hello and welcome to Consit, County Durham, the home of the Irwin Heimer Group in the UK. The Irwin Heimer Group UK encompasses such brands as Eldis, Compass, Buccaneer and Explore. And today we are at their 2023 preview and the opening of their new £2.8 million PDI building. That's the building for pre-delivery inspections. Erwin Heimer Group are really investing heavily in the concept factory at the moment to improve everything. And as such, the 2023 season is a bit of a low key launch. What the Erwin Heimer Group appear to be doing is just simply fulfilling established orders and letting the dust settle, getting, getting their house into order before really hitting it hard for 2024. So there's very little new for the new season, but there is some news. We've got the beautiful new Eldis Crusader and Compass Caminos, now with Buccaneer exterior styling. And there's also a couple of new motorhomes on the new longer 115 chassis, that's the Eldis AutoQuest 115, and the Compass Avant Garde 115, which we'll look at in a different video. But for now, let's take a quick look at the new kids on the block, the Eldis Crusader Tempest and the Compass Camino 668 in their very smart new body shells. Okay, so let's start with the Eldis Crusader Tempest. And as we can see, I've always been very fond of the shape of that Buccaneer. And now to see it in the Eldis, form is uh, it just looks so good it's got a very simple clean line to the front as you can see what do you reckon Dougal he's not impressed as you can see too we're on still on the Alco chassis nice long a-frame there gonna help towing stability and we still got retain the uh, the gray sides with the uh, sort of purple movie accents so it is a very very smart looking caravan indeed have a quick look at the back it really is top notch oh Dougal you could cheer up I'm oh, sorry you're not coming in sorry look at the size of that front locker I mean that is huge enormous and very very large so here we are with the locker door open and I was really excited when I saw the size of the front locker until I saw the depth of it. You're not going to get an acro roll in there, more's the pity. And we've got the whale, easy slide, barbecue point. Now it's at this point I would like to say a huge thank you to whale who have sponsored this video and as you can see the easy slide. No flapping. I've had a caravan with a barbecue point that flapped, and my goodness, it's annoying. But no flapping with the whale easy slide, so yeah, even fitted to the most premium caravans such as the Eldis Crusader Tempest. So a massive thank you to Whale who have sponsored this video and allowed us to come and show you what's new from the Irwin Heimer Group UK. Let's have, have a look inside. Remember, this is the Eldis one we're looking at. So Eldis has the lighter bodywork, uh, the lighter furniture between the two, between Eldis and Compass. So we have this lovely, I'm in love with the upholstery. Really, really premium. Look at that. Oh dear, someone's, someone's mucked with the, uh, the curtain ties there. David Bell's not going to like that untidy pleatage. Sorry, David. Lots of light coming in through all those sky roofs and sun roofs and everything else. So this is a six berth caravan, mo a, most aim aimed mostly at a family of four. A huge kitchen to, for family meals, three gas burners, one electric hot plate, and then the Huge, large, enormous, and very big 
Dometic Series 10 fridge, complete with annoying LEDs. Russell Hobbs microwave, we've got an Omnivent, it's just got the lot really. And we have a central washroom. So, lovely shower here with a shower rail. And then opposite that is the very swish washroom. So the camera's having a little bit of trouble with the sun streaming in the, the, uh, the County Durham sunshine. And of course, we've got the mirror for the all important. Hello. Sorry. And then finally, we come through to the main bedroom. So we got a bed for the parents there. And then on the other side of the bedroom, we have two bunk beds for the wee ones. Obviously there are lights fitted to the bunk beds. And we've even got a TV point here. So you can have a TV in the bedroom. Nice solid sliding door. There you go. So you can partition the bedroom off and also get plenty of privacy in the washroom so even though it's a family caravan you do get full privacy in the washroom very nice radiator that Alder central heating of course so this is the lovely Eldis Crusader Tempest now let's pop across and look at its Compass sibling, the Compass Camino 668. So here we have the Compass Camino 668, just to sort of give you a direct comparison really between this and the eldest brand. Liking that with the uh, the badge. And this is a, a darker, more bluey grey body shell compared to the lighter grey on the Eldis, super, super smart. But we're in the same Buccaneer body shell and we still got that, I just love the this, this smooth front, really, really love it. And still got the longer A-frame. So let's just have a very quick look in here to give you a, a comparison between the two. So as you come in, you can see straight away the difference. It's the wood is darker in the compass. So I hope the uh, the camera is picking this up, but it really is a, a much darker, almost sort of more more stately home, if you like, than the uh, than the lighter Eldis. Really gives it quite a stately feel, it really does. But it's nice to see that you've got this alternative. But yeah, it's really uh, quite a solid looking van. And just like all Eldest Crusaders and Compass Caminos, this is eight feet wide. What do you reckon to that, Dougal? He's not impressed. Is he ever? So there you have it, folks. I hope you enjoyed that sneak preview of the 2023 Eldis Crusader Tempest and Compass Camino 668. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, you know what to do. Please give us a thumbs up, subscribe if you don't already. And it just leaves me to say from Dougal and from me, thanks for tuning in. There. What did you think of those caravans, Dougal? Are you excited about the new 2023 season? Are you excited? Are you excited? Hey. Hey. He never smiles. Dougal, you could be a bit more enthusiastic about it. You could, you could just show a bit more engagement, a bit more. No. <laughs>